You know, you can't invent just because you want to. You know, it's just like if you want to be a famous musician and you want to be excellent at an instrument, you don't just sit down at a piano or pick up a guitar and be a wonderful musician. It takes years and years of hard work and practice. Hi, I'm John Wanna, the President and Chief Technology Officer of the Wanna Babcock Institute and co-founder of Beyond Benign. People sometimes think that an inventor just does one narrow thing. But actually, if you apply creativity and imagination to invention, you find that there's not a big difference between inventing the solar energy technology that works in low light. So imagine your cell phone, if you keep it in the, just the ambient room, that it's constantly charging and you never plug it in and inventing an additive that goes into pavement to make the pavement more sustainable and, and more recyclable. You know, there's just so many of them, we're having such fun doing these things, but it's because what we have is people who've dedicated their lives to learning about materials and staying in school and learning about how to invent. There are so many important problems in the world today that have to do with how we do the most simplest things. You know, the materials that our automobiles are made out of, the materials that our computers are made out of, the way that we grow plants for food, the way that we design and make clothing. Everything we do right now has some bad impact on the human health and the environment. There are things that are making people sick, there are things that are causing global climate change, and so everything needs a new way of doing it. And the world has had chemists, have had people doing this for, you know, a hundred years. But what we need now is a new set of eyes, a new set of ideas. We need you and other people to be getting into this, to be saying, I don't accept that these things have to cause bad things for humans in the environment. I don't accept that this is the way it has to be. And so we have an opportunity for people to learn how does the world make things? How does the world use things? How does the world dispose of things? And then learn science, learn chemistry, learn engineering, and find a way to say, I'm gonna change the world. And going to change the world by the way we make things, by the way we do things. And we need everybody to step up to the plate and be part of this very important program.